Well, we're keeping an eye on a marginal severe weather threat today and again tomorrow. We have a stalled frontal boundary with some uh, moisture coming up from the Gulf of Mexico riding along that front with very heavy rainfall. Flash flood watches continue in many spots and we're going to have lingering thunderstorms yet even into this upcoming weekend. Yesterday was a little bit warmer in Philadelphia and D.C. topping out at almost 90. We had uh, mid 80s in New York City and Boston. Same for Burlington. Uh, temperatures again running pretty close to average. Well above average though on Caribou. Uh, by 10 degrees or so. And then pockets of heavy rain, Portland 80 to 100 of an inch, Philadelphia about to 4 tenths of an inch, and then a quarter of an inch there in D.C. and Charleston. So we do have more flash flood watches continuing from southern New York all the way down to the Florida Panhandle. And within this particular zone, we could see anywhere from one to maybe two inch rainfall tallies. So again, decent rainfall amounts continuing along that front, even along the coast. And then maybe even in an isolated severe threat from western Massachusetts down to northern Virginia. Looks like wind Wind and hail would be the primary concern. Here's that forecast. Showers and thunderstorms continuing to pop up here through the day. And then uh, we'll see lingering showers and storms overnight tonight with more redeveloping thunderstorms and locally heavy rain into your Friday. In fact, tomorrow we have another marginal threat from the northern New England states to uh, near Washington, D.C. with more rain, or I should say hail and high wind potential there. Temperatures will be warmer ahead of that front. We're calling for uh, near 90 degree highs in Boston, New York, Philly, and D.C.